We like people who are interested in us. So one of the most useful ways to build rapport and gain friends and all that stuff is to show interest non-verbally, right? So to look like you're interested. But this is the problem, is when we think that somebody's trying to get something out of us, we don't like it. So for example, one of my students approaches to me after class and is like, oh, excuse me, um, professor, I loved your lecture. I think this was the best lecture you ever gave. And then all of a sudden, like five minutes later, oh yeah, by the way, I'm going to, I'm going to um, Puerto Rico with my boyfriend next. Is it okay if I miss the test? I don't like that because it was a compliment followed by, you know, some sort of they want something. One of the things that people mistake when they feign nonverbals is they do it 100% of the time. So I can show you that, you know, like this is, oh, I'm interested in you. Oh, where are you? tell me more. Da, 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 da. And it looks like I'm really interested. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But the average person can't maintain this for long. So one of the things you need to do is if you want to fake body language, you don't do it 100% of the time. You do it like 70. It's not natural for you to do something 100% of the time. People don't interact like that. If one person's incredibly interested in somebody, they don't look like this nonstop for 30 minutes. It's not possible. Human attention spans aren't that long. So when you act like you're interested, you don't want to do it a lot. You want to do it 70%. It's more organic.